Hey guys, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be tackling the master bedroom. If you're new to my channel, I just want to say welcome and I hope you enjoy. So I'm starting out by cleaning my ceiling fan. It's actually not that dirty. But usually what I like to do is start at the top and work my way down so the dust falls downward. I usually clean my fans about two to three times a year as needed. It does get pretty dusty where I'm at. Next, I'm picking a corner of the room and working around the room in a clockwise motion. Over here, I'm starting with the shutters and then moving on to my bedside table. You can actually see the dust particles flying around. use one product Lines weren't that dusty, so I'm just quickly wiping them down. That room in there is just a sitting room, and right now we don't have a whole lot going on in there. We used to use that area for the kids to hang out and watch TV, but we have since moved the TV into their playroom now that my younger two share a bedroom. Right off our bedroom is a little balcony area. Where we live, it hardly ever rains, but when it does, it's so nice to go sit out there and listen to the rain. So this is the dresser that has the piece of glass on it and the end dust works really good on this surface as well. So the little black device there next to the flowers is the Echo Dot and we love that thing. We have them throughout the house and we use them as an intercom system to call out to the kids when dinner's ready so we don't have to holler up and down the stairs. Just cleaning off my messy dresser hair and as you can see I'm a little bit of a hoarder when it comes to body sprays and perfumes. These roads intersect on each one I reflect These lines write my story These places change me Each one replacing Like night into morning I miss the open Moving on to the last corner of the bedroom, this is my husband's side. So who out there are thrifty shoppers and like to buy furniture secondhand? The white pieces of furniture and the two chairs on either side of the bed we scored on Facebook swap pages who both happened to be sold by friends of mine, which was funny. But we got really good deals on both of them. It's always such a good feeling when you save money and still get quality pieces of furniture. The endless journey I need not worry. And now 
on to the best part, making the bed. This will make any room look clean. Well, for the most part. Having white sheets is so nice when doing laundry, just because if you want to add the bleach, you can, and you don't have to worry about it. Okay, anyone notice anything? Yeah, I found a little nice surprise there. My four-year-old left his toy. Lastly, I'm just using this carpet deodorizer and vacuuming to finish it up. There's just something about a clean, fresh smelling room. So inviting. so much for watching i hope you've enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more cleaning videos and diys see you in the next one bye